Hello guys, Sulfini here and today I'm going to share with you guys a recipe for Mexican mole. And first off, I'm going to start off listing the ingredients before moving on to a more visual list. If you can't find any of these ingredients in your local supermarket, make sure to check your local Mexican shop, they will carry all of these ingredients. For the ingredients we will need half a teaspoon of cumin, a half of a small onion, 5 cloves of garlic, 6 whole Japanese chili pods, 8 to 10 whole black peppercorn, 3 whole cloves, and a half of a cinnamon stick. Moving on with the list, you will need 1 Nord chicken bouillon cube, 8 guajillo chilies, a half a bottle of Doña Maria mole sauce, you can find them at the store in a glass bottle. You will also need a fourth of a Nestle Abuelita chocolate bar. You can find them at the store, it's usually used to make hot chocolate. You will need a whole chicken or as many pieces of chicken as you want, three whole Roma tomatoes and vegetable oil. This is just a visual list of the ingredients. If you wish to skip over this, you can skip over to minute 206 of this video. So first we start off the stew by adding water and chicken to a pot. Next you will add the 1 fourth of the onion. You will then add the 3 garlic cloves and the 1 nor bouillon cube, although I am adding 2 in this video to make it a little stronger. And lastly you do need some salt. I did not add exact quantities because this is up to you. So after an hour of cooking, your chicken stew should look something like this. Next we will grill our ingredients on a pan and if you want to, you can actually use a tin foil so that it's easier to clean your pan later on. For the ingredients, we will need a fourth of an onion, 2 garlic cloves, 3 Roma tomatoes, 6 Japanese chili pods, 8 guajillo chilies, and half a cinnamon stick. We will now add all of the ingredients that we just grilled on the pan into a blender and in addition we will also add the 1 fourth abuelita chocolate bar, a half a teaspoon of cumin and 8 to 10 black peppercorn. Next we add 1 cup of chicken broth to the blender. We will add some oil to a saute pan while the blender does its job. Next we will open up the Doña Maria bottle of mole and we will add half of it to the mix. Take another cup of chicken broth from the chicken soup and add it to the mix and mix it up again. Now we will add the mix to the oil in the saute pan. You can rinse the blender with some chicken broth and you can add it back into the saute pan. Don't be afraid to use too much chicken broth, it's really tasty. Use a little spoon to evenly stir up the mix together. It is now time to add the pieces of chicken from the chicken soup into the mix. Cover up the pieces of chicken with the chili mix and then you will let it cook together for about 15 minutes on medium heat. Your mole is now ready to serve. Typically it's served right next to some rice, but you can eat it alone or with whatever you want. Remember to like and subscribe because I will be making some more cooking videos in the future guys. Thank you guys very much for watching and enjoy the rest of your day.